I'm Holly Peterson from Cleveland Clinic. Uh, I'm part of the medical breast team and professor of medicine at Cleveland Clinic Lerner College of Medicine. And I'm here to discuss our abstract uh, use of a multi-ancestry polygenic risk score to help predict triple negative breast cancer in young black women. We looked at a cohort of over 17,500 black women who had presented for genetic counseling and testing over a one-year period from August 2022 until September of 2023. And of those uh, women, uh, over 3,000 had a personal history of breast cancer, and the remainder had a family history of breast cancer for which they were undergoing genetic testing. And the background on this study is that Young black women in particular are prone to triple negative breast cancer, which is a particularly biologically aggressive form of breast cancer. And it occurs earlier in black women and they have a much higher rate of mortality. Um, young women in general, people I don't think realize, 19% um, of women who develop breast cancer are under the age of 50 and 23% of black women who develop breast cancer are under the age of 50. And young black women in particular are prone to triple negative breast cancer. So we looked at the cohort in terms of using this multi-ancestry polygenic risk score to see whether women who develop breast cancer and particularly young women who develop triple negative breast cancer had a higher polygenic load. And in fact, women who develop breast cancer, the top 5% of the polygenic risk score, those women were twice as likely than an average woman to develop breast cancer. And if you look at triple negative breast cancer in particular, the upper 5% of the polygenic risk score, those women are over twice as likely to develop breast cancer. So you can see the potential implications of this in terms of identifying young women who are at risk for breast cancer and screening them appropriately so that it can potentially be identified early or pre prevented altogether. Thank you.